What is going on guys, Judo Sloth here and today I have a Lavaloon 3 star attack for you against this Town Hall 10 from one of our recent practice wars. Now this is something new that we've brought into Mayhem Rising where once a week the pressure of winning the war isn't important and it's all about you improving your attacking ability. And for me, I'm using this to improve my Lava Loon attack because it's something I've always struggled with. Dropping the Lava Hounds and the Loons in that clockwise, anti-clockwise movement, I just can't seem to get the timing down. I always seem to rush in with my balloons just too quickly. So starting out on this first raid, I'm attacking from the west side where I'm hoping to get two of the air defense, hopefully that Inferno Tower, but also the Archer Queen. You'll see that I opt for a shattered approach on this attack, so I have the golems and just a couple of wizards that created a nice funnel, and then I have a jump spell to get access in towards that inferno tower. The king is in there, but he's not quite going to get that down, but once the archer queen finishes with this second air defense, she's going to turn around, get that inferno tower, so we've taken out everything we wanted from this initial part of the attack. Moving on to the air portion of the attack, I have two Lava Hounds cut in from separate angles towards the northern air defense and then surgically deploying my balloons on each of the defenses that are being tanked for. I'm then trying to cover as much ground as I can with my haste spells. Wanted to power my balloons to the Moultrie Inferno with that rage spell but I think I misplaced it a little bit as I did with my freeze spell because I completely missed that air sweeper. I'm then bringing in my third Lava Hound to that final air defense. I definitely didn't save enough balloons for this side. That's one thing that, as I say, I always seem to struggle with. I either put too many balloons in or I put them in too quickly. I'm using my last haste spell to try and power the balloons forward towards that wizard tower. And again, one thing I know I should have been doing is saving at least one balloon for that final wizard tower to bring in and keep it distracted. And that was one of my ideas for the bowler troop, actually, was to try and snipe off the final wizard tower so we didn't even have to deal with it but actually I found there are very few bases designed that would allow you to do that it would save me from using that balloon but maybe I should start bringing a giant instead just so that I don't use them all as I did in this raid so there you have it guys, I did manage to pull off the 3 star with Lava Loon, definitely helped that there was no castle troops, I know it may have been a very different story if there was, just before I start reading that in the comments, but please share any tips you have with me, I mainly struggle with the deployment of the Lava Hounds and the Balloons, so any tips will be much appreciated, and I will bring you more attacks from our practice wars, so hopefully this is a strategy you can see me improving on in up and coming videos, but I will continue to bring you other strategies and regular war attacks as normal but that wraps it up for today's video subscribe for lots more clash of clans i've been your host judo sloth and until next time peace out guys stay tuned for more clash of clans